Hi there, welcome to the hand walks or better known as the, the inchworms. Great warm up uh, movement or exercise to have in your toolbox, especially targeting warming up the joints of the wrists, elbows, shoulders, ankles, knees, hips, and the deep postural muscles of the body. So it's very much an all encompassing one, gets the heart rate up, gets things warmed up nicely. So remember the model is key points, set up, execution, recipe for success in all exercises and movements. So things to pay attention to, so key points is to make sure that while you're performing the movement, you're nice and soft and deliberate in your walk out, okay, or your inch worm, ensuring that you are shrink wrapping your abdominals into your spine, so think belly button to spine, so that you're not letting them go and loose where the low back takes um, more of the effort in supporting the spine in that area. Also, you might feel it quite a bit in your hamstring depending on how restricted you are there. So don't force it. That's why we do a bunch in succession to allow the body the opportunity to stretch and warm up and open, all right? So there are some key points and this is what it ends up looking like. I'm gonna do them in one place if you've got the room. You're able to do them one after the other, okay? So you're standing tall. You're reaching down to the ground. You're going to walk out, being kind to those joints. Full plank position. This is where your tummy's tight. And you start ankling your feet in. You'll go to fingertips to give yourself a little more room to come in. So this is, I'm feeling a little tight, so this is where I stop. You can walk it back. Nice exhale, good stretch, feel through the low back. And then you can repeat. So you'll reach down to the ground, nice and controlled. Tummy tight, full plank, ankling it in, go to fingertips, get a little bit more room, walk it back, good exhale at the end, and you want to do a bunch of those so that you get the good release and the good warm up.